these. Let's get them. What do you think? Nice and stable. Very good. You're not sinking on the side. <laughs> It somehow seems a lot higher. Huh? <laughs> Does it seem a lot higher? Hello. <laughs> Let's put your harness on. Come on then. Head in. Good boy. That's not too much even next door. Alright, can you come closer? Good boy. There it is. It just about fits in. Like it can actually stretch a bit further, but I think there's like very slight gaps between the boards because they fold. Um, so I can push it in enough. <laughs> but I mean, when he jumps up, he tends to jump there and sort of slips into that bit. So he's got one leg there, one there. So I mean, that's me leaning my weight on it, and it's not going down. So. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be quite good. <laughs> Literally only just fits into the back of the chairs. I haven't had to move anything, so no seats have gone forward or anything. This is all nice and snug. It's the um, P-Cute one I got. And then it's got the gaps in that. These bits go up and then they zip on each side. Yeah, that's good. There's even like um, a rod through this to keep that rigid, which the other ones didn't have. Um, and then I've got this thing because of how hard it is. Um, it's pretty cute on the other side, but I'll probably put it this way up. And then I've got a bit of a cushioning because it is hard. I definitely think he's a bit taller. <laughs> <laughs> he just seems like he's a bit higher. I think because he's not sinking on the side. What do you think? Is that better? You gonna stop sliding around? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see how stable you are for going along. You already tied yourself up with Bundy. I'm going to be printing the t-shirts this morning so yeah if you've ordered one of our t-shirts already that's wonky and that's bothering me <laughs> um if you ordered a t-shirt then i am working on that right now i'm gonna start with veronica because yours was ordered first so veronica wanted a ktsp i have 12 t-shirts to print <laughs> and i'm so new to this i look centered <laughs> I'm sure I'll get quicker at this, <laughs> hopefully. My little mini press <laughs> coming up the top. Of the I just need to put my little 
it's lost. Thank you, Nick. Um, sorry about the weird angle, but you're partially standing on the embroidery table because I need all of this space. Um, for getting me t-shirts done. <laughs> I need something to put my thing. Um, buddy. Okay. I'm getting into the sewing a bit, a little bit. Um, whipped out a tape measure so that I can check measurements at the sides. Just make sure that it's positioned correctly. Um, so far I've done Veronica's, Mandy's and Sarah's. Sarah wanted the established, this one. Um, Veronica got KTSD, and Mandy got KTSD, and now I'm working on John's. So I've done a pre-press, which is what we're meant to do first. It kind of takes out moisture, for, any moisture from the t-shirt helps the thing bond, I think. <laughs> also smooths out any creases, not that there are any in this anyway. Um, and then use the heat tape to secure it down. And doing the neck labels last on all of them because it saves having the little heat press out in the way. Uh, and it turned itself off anyway, it got bored of not being touched because I was faffing around with this too much and you can't see anything now. Uh, there we go. Uh, okay, I'm put the Teflon over the top to protect the machine. And then it goes down 160 degrees C uh, for 15 seconds. Um, and then I can peel it off. me having to cut any pieces of tape. I just reuse them for as long as they're sticky enough. And then it goes back in again for a five second press. Just helps to bond the transfer. A huge thank you to everybody that has been ordering my t-shirt. The people that have been excited for them <laughs> and when I couldn't actually release them because I didn't have the transfers and people were asking me why they weren't on the website yet. Um, it just makes me so happy that people actually like them and want to buy them.
so far. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven of the KTSD design I've sold. Four of the grey Siberian Rhapsody. My friend actually came up with that idea. Somebody I used to work with. Um, and, uh, and then two of the established I've sold. It's funny because this was actually my favourite one. Um, and it's always the way, the ones that I really like, I don't know if it's popular. I mean, I love this one, which is the most popular one. Here we go. That's Amanda's t-shirt. Next up we have Alison. Gonna be a bit harder to position because it doesn't have nice straight edges. <laughs> and so the other orders I will be doing today because probably not any good to just keep recording this. It's the same process over and over again. The t-shirts I'm going to be doing for Alison, William, Craig, Katie. Because uh, Craig's got two. William's got two, Claire as well. So Veronica, Mandy, John, Amanda, Alison, William, Craig, Katie, Claire, and Sarah. Those are everybody that's wanted a t-shirt so far. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Thought I'd come back to show you a little bit of doing the great ones because I've done all of the dark ones. Uh, Apart from the neck labels, I haven't done all of those yet. Just one on Veronica's to start with. Uh, and now I'm working on the grey t-shirts. So these ones are kind of difficult but easier to centre <laughs> because they're round. I measure uh, here, the widest point, and measure the text. bottom up first and I only have to correct the bottom that one time instead of twice. I say and then I have to correct it anyway. <laughs> so good. How neat is that? Definitely prefer doing it that way. There's 13 t-shirts all done. You can definitely tell which one was the most popular. For these ones, and then these ones, and then these ones. Hey, thank you so much for ordering our t-shirts. I'm so happy that you like them. 